Hello and welcome everyone, my name's Kenny. This is beer. This is my beer review Friday weekly thing. If you're new here, make sure you consider subscribing, leave a comment, like, all that stuff. This is a weekly event here. It might have to develop into bi-weekly even more as there is so many beers out there I need to try. But today we have this beautiful scald guy. Look at that beard and bandana. He's ready to ride some motorcycles and plunder some booty. Driving that haze, right? He's still brewery. I don't remember where these guys are out of. Illinois? Anyway, um, I've had these guys before. I've done a review on my channel of them before. It was very impressive stuff. And this is the same thing. Beautiful can art. I love it. I'd proudly display something like this on my wall in the basement. Um, I apologize for my over whiteness. It is becoming very nice in Minnesota. It's quite nice today, quite warm today. And we're drinking some beer in the sun. Damn. So 7% alcohol by volume. Beautiful color. Very light, very crisp tasting. We got cashmere, which is a new flavor of mine. I love that one. Amarillo and Cinco Cups. <laughs> Boycott plants, pure flavor. Absolutely. We all should do the same. This is a very good one. If you can see, I don't know, what does the shirt say again? Oh yeah, the coffee is strong with this one. It's, it's like stewy, like their favorite thing, right? Kind of looking guy, little baby, I don't know, I just assume it's stewy. I don't know. <sighs> but yeah, I like the color in here. We got, we got RGB on the side, so if you're a PC nerd like me, RGB. That's what you want in your beer, as well as your computer. Cat in the background. He's outside in his little tent, enjoying the fine weather. But this is a very, very good beer. Ooh. Like I said, I love the color of this one. The color of it matches the taste and the lightness. It's super, super light, super crispy, ultra refreshing. Hot day like today. It's a beautiful day, yes, but oh, very good beer. Well, he tipped it over again. He's having a good time. He's trying to get that fresh grass. Did I already say 7% alcohol by volume and 55 IBUs? Very light on the IBU score. Wind is picking up. I like these cashmere hops. They they seem to lend themselves to this lighter, crisper flavor. Driving that haze. I need to make a trip down here and drive myself down there, Illinois. Distill. I I just love their logo, man. Their can art is so cool. It's simple yet really cool. The colors. Oh. It's kind of like our Dangerous Man brew in, in Minneapolis here, but kind of going up there. How you doing, buddy? You okay? We'll go inside in a little bit. He's probably getting a little warm, sitting in the sun and stuff, but he hasn't been in there very long. Don't worry about it. We should focus on the beer, and we should focus on the grass. It's so light, the hot flavor, the bitterness, a little low, get a little bit on the back side. Absolutely stunning. This is a knockout for a hazy IP. It's, it's really good in a market flooded with hazy IPs. These guys stand out. It's very good. They did a good, good, good job. <sighs> Well, I think that's about all I really need to say about this one. It's really tasty, simple, 
alcohol. You know, very light tasting, easy to drink. Mmm, very good. Deadhead IPA series. Absolutely. Driving that haze. Make sure you pick this one up if it is available to you. Uh, make sure you like, comment, and some consider subscribing. Otherwise, thanks for hanging out. Enjoy your Friday. Enjoy your beer. Let me know what you're drinking. Let them know what else I need to try. Otherwise, thanks for hanging out. Enjoy your Friday and uh, get some get some sun. I need it. I look terrible. I'm so white. I'm so white. Take it easy.